welcome to Team No Gaming. I am your host, Jake Blade. Here with me today, Mr. Ark Rose, the player, Desert Eagle Lady Andy, and others may come and go as we play. We've got a special guest, Cool Cadence, here today. Oh, again? Again, yes. And we are here with The Walking Dead. Yeah. God, man, this was an amazing game. But yeah, I was like, I remember watching uh, Cry and PewDiePie play, and it was pretty well, good. I mean, I just love the whole episodic thing. I mean, you know, they did it with with The Walking Dead. They did it with um, with The Wolf Among Us. I Wolf love Among The Wolf Among Us. I can't wait for season two. Oh, so, I mean, they have quite a few IPs now for if it. If I remember yeah. correctly, this was their first one that came yeah. out The Walking Dead. Yeah. But I, throughout the times that this has been out, I've have not really seen much on it, so this is going to be a whole new thing for me. Right. Yeah. The other series, two series I've been playing is Life is Strange and uh, Tales of Borderlands. Oh, oh, Tales of Borderlands. <laughs> and, uh, I like the most recent one. That's been today. Hilarious. What, what is today? The 17th? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, well, um, and three more days, the new episode of Life is Strange comes out. The last Woo! episode. The last episode, the, the finale. We figure out what's going on exactly, and... All that stuff. But anyways, this is The Walking yes. Dead. <laughs> yeah. So, let, let's start playing. Um, I think standard would be good Standard for is okay. Yeah, we we'll go with that. So that way everybody understands. A new day. A new day. whoop de doo <laughs> Just another day in paradise. Yeah, yeah right. One yeah. person's paradise is another person's nightmare. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that, that's beyond true. Uh, I, think that, I think that would be Co Covenant's fucking saying... Yeah. He's like, he's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> he's outside, by the way. Yeah. So is uh, Curse and uh, Sierra. Yep. They're all outside. Some pieces. Walking Dead. Yeah. Previously on The Walking Dead. Everyone dies! So <laughs> <laughs> one. different because you know the whole cell shading thing but yeah, it still looks pretty good yeah hey it's a nice shot well right there. I reckon you didn't do it then oh. <laughs> I was about to say you might want to keep your hands on that controller does it really matter nah not ah, much. he's glitching! <laughs> you know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the... I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you did. It's <laughs> hey, a guy shot like a I don't know how fast can you drink. <laughs> <laughs> it depends, really. Wow, when you give him an energy drink, it's gone in like two minutes. Yeah. I follow the case a little time. bit. You being yeah. a making boy and all. Yeah. Up until you know he just transcends time and space. What do you think? I'm just glad yes. I chose law and not order. Big messy trial like that. Even if you was innocent. A lot of what happened can't ever be undone. I was say, the guy has a very twitchy neck, it looks like. <laughs> I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. <laughs> Regardless, it could be you just married the wrong woman. That's kind of what happens <laughs> in San Andreas. <laughs> Any of 
that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. Yeah, this don't look too good. <laughs> I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop. That's government like property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and nah. having exhausted all his options, you, he starts <laughs> crying out for his mama. No, don't wanna, don't wanna it's all a big mistake. Now. It wasn't me. Yeah, the entire game just be on Yeah, it's very cute. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, <laughs> cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show. People will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more... I love her, I do say so. This other time... Gun out. Hey, hey, officer, are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. I just read a whole thing uh, yesterday of uh, game logic. Uh, I have to be as sneaky as possible. Damn it! Shouts reloading as loud as fucking possible. Of course. Come on, put some force behind it. I need to drag myself out that window. So do it. Yeah. You know, listen to Shia LaBeouf. Just do it! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, could you imagine all the zombies were in place with Shia LaBeouf? <laughs> I can see it being like a mod for like Daisy. He does still kind of have handcuffs on. He has armpits. True, but that'd be really <laughs> awkward trying to get it. Get out. Officer? Kick him. God damn. Officer? God damn. <laughs> <laughs> A shotgun chest. So I guess I am going to have to get the shotgun uh, 
take off the handcuffs. Instead of doing something a lot quieter, but hey. Looks empty. So loaded. It'll so be like, easier to carry with these cuffs off. <sighs> See, to me, logic would dictate. Shotgun shell? Shotgun. <gasps> the officer's shotgun is over there. Alright, well, um. Officer? Maybe he has the key. Your cuffs. It wouldn't let me do anything, though. Maybe you have to go up closer. Okay. It's not like earlier. We had to scoot towards the window. That'd be the right spot. Of course. But these games are all about being precise. Shit! That's what she said. Ooh! Yes, yes, that's what Katie said. Let me guess, he's gonna come along, isn't he? Huh! <laughs> Or there's gonna be a zombie behind me. No one ever pays attention behind them. Of course, because that would be logical. <coughs> Officer. <laughs> Holy yeah, shit! One leg. <laughs> He oh, gets yeah. even alive. That was as quiet as possible. Don't you know, yo? Shotguns are silenced. <laughs> that would be horrifying. That would be very horrifying. <laughs> Out of the front. His skin's all rotten and he smells I like shit. Have. What the hell is this? I was say, he was old, he was already rotting, so, you know, what's the deal? Are you dead? Hey! <laughs> are you dead? Oh, he's just missing about 70% of his skull. <laughs> I'm just gonna shout to me, get attention. Help! Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! <laughs> uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry, but that... There's a shooting! He was shooting! I did! Ah! 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 <laughs> yes. Hello. Alone style. Anybody? Hey, a pool. You should be able to move around. That's 
some awesome tree elves. Anybody up there? No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. Damn. Help! The tea set. Fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. <laughs> I wonder if anybody's home. Yes, while you're, you know, moving like one of the zombies. Well, you know. And inside. Hello. Anybody home? I need a little help. I need some bourbon in a teacup. <laughs> Hello. Right, suddenly just last right to have everyone the fuck out of yourself. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Oh look, I did have to break the door. <laughs> Don't shoot. Also, he flies back five feet. <laughs> There's someone with a hot gun. Ah! Oh, this is a scary Hello. I'm not an intruder. No. I'm one of them. Speaking of Sierra, these people might need more help than I've I seen do. the first episode of the new King's Quest game. It's definitely old style. Unicorn! It's so fluffy! <laughs> hey, but. <laughs> Oops. Right when I saw it, too. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, that started to look like my floor the other day. I accidentally stepped on a piece of glass and didn't realize it. But that's the type of thing you would leave the Oh, shit! What's that beeping? Yes, still one walkie-talkie. This place has been ransacked. Just about anything worthwhile is gone. Really? You open it two more inches? Of, of course! Classic crap. Can always pull a prank on it. There are three new messages. <sighs> yeah, I think you have to go check the voicemail. I'm laughing made you slip again. <laughs> I like looking around. It's fake. Damn. <laughs> you can still eat it. Whether or not it's actually edible is a whole other story. What? Maybe there's something on there. Really? No, it's only going, hey, three messages. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, well, he's not feeling well enough to drive back yeah. tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, yeah, and I sense. promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. 
Fishing 911 number. Well, Daddy? Is it? Huh? 119 or whatever. Over in Britain, England, whatever. Hello? In the UK. You need to be quiet. So they make it a 27 digit number. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. House. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. Yeah. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Find you. Break his neck. <laughs> 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 Adventures <laughs> in baby thing. <laughs> Man. Hi there. Hi there. Just murdered your babysitter. I guess I'm your new guardian now. Did you now. kill it? There can only be one. I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? Our faces no, asleep. but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. Don't blame you. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you turned. too. So what should we do hey, now? Hey, Sophie! We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Back with the awesomeness. Yes. Let's go. And we've only Stay just close. murdered a babysitter with a camera. You didn't murder her. Not that kind of baby. Babysitter. The center of the baby is the person who sits on the baby. Wow, that's gross. Why would you let him hear your kids? No. And convicts out like a white. <laughs> wow, yeah. Oh, what is it? Get it down there some time and just leave it up here. Get back to the game. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to mom with this one. Sorry. Ring. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? 
I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. I thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Yes, the chomp. There's a new STD going around. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those are all over the damn place. The I haven't chomp. seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown at least like <coughs> 15 miles back. Oh, I like that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. <laughs> Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. Be honest. <laughs> Just some guy. Some guy? Uh, yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... Them monsters come out. We gotta go. Them monsters come out. Leave quick. Let's go. Yes, Chad, you're definitely doing a lot of help. For just some guy, it seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. Well, well, you know, during the apocalypse, I don't think anyone's going to give a flying fuck. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Zombie police officer. Stop in the name of <laughs> Fine for your time is brains. <laughs> Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. Snit? I'll catch you tomorrow what night. The fuck is a snit? It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Some old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame. I think it's supposed to be like a John Deere. I wouldn't have made it back without you. But this is a Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Actually, it's supposed to be from the show. Season two. You've brought a couple guests. We just need a little help. We won't stay long. Good. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You I'm take a seat up on the doctor, porch and I'll go see what uh, I have. Well, he's a veterinarian. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Let's have a look. Yeah. This is swollen to hell. Well, that's what happens when you walk on it. Could be worse. Could be worse. Yeah. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. Car accident. That's so. Where were you headed before the car accident? It's up to you. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. 
Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who were you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. <laughs> we got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there. And we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been uh, through, Clementine. So adorable. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. You said that word around the kid. Your son's right. You're gonna oh, want to shame. fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. <laughs> Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Okay, just Tell one. What you saw out there, man. <laughs> But if we're gonna say anything else, we gotta, you know, gotta murder more zombies with dick. claw hammers. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Me and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already I said that's okay. a requirement. <laughs> well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. <laughs> okay. It's a bad <laughs> joke. <laughs> yeah, I was like, there's blankets and such yeah. in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right then. It smells like... Smells well, like wasabi. <laughs> Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Plops. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite the word I would have... I miss my yes. mom and dad. I bet, Cliff. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Okay. Nations like eternal darkness. <laughs> hey, get up. Mm. Itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? Oh, I'm, uh, Kenny. Not her dad. Babe, sleep. I'm Kenny. I love Kenny. There's a tractor and everything! They kill Kenny! It's stuck! We better get going, oh or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken bastards. Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? <laughs> yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable treat lately. <laughs> no kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's, he's dumb very much a redneck. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. Well, it's pretty damn near confirmed that that Word is, you were on your way to Macon. My well, family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can <laughs> knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Mm. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. <laughs> yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Yeah, sit Duck on the and the I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. 
Uh, what was her name? So, uh, I know. Didn't. What was her nickname like Cat? Who? Katcha, that's it. Katcha, yeah. Katcha. Katcha. Hey there, girls. Katcha, Katcha. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Oh, you're just all kinds of bundled up. <laughs> Hey, why don't you just this could all be play the old problems, you know? Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening. Got Batman behind us. What you being now? Maybe this will work out. Your optimism is refreshing. Why? New. Why is this happening? Oh, days at God. I'm gonna show you what I do. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. All right, and uh, <laughs> this is so wrong, dude. Yeah. All right. Well, I think we will call that an episode, and we will continue on in the next episode. Like and subscribe if you're enjoying the series and want to see more. Check out some of our other playlists, and we will see you next time. Peace. Later. Bye, guys. See ya. Bye. Oh, Bye. He just dying ass house.